So with Halhun's principle, we saw how a simple geometric idea about how light propagates can actually give you real results. Halhun's principle predicted uh, reflection accurately and it predicted refraction accurately. Now we're going to look at another similar idea, a simple geometrical principle. Fermat's principle. And here's Fermat, there he is, Pierre. All right, and now what it says is it's a similar simple geometrical idea. The path a beam of light takes between two points is the one that takes the least time. It sounds more elegant in French. So if you imagine two points, A and B, this, A here, and B here. And you have, for whatever reason, light going from A to B, shining a laser, flashlight, whatever it is. If light is gonna go from A to B, it's gonna take the path of least time. And if you assume light travels at a constant speed, travels at the speed of light, then the least time would be the least distance. So the light will go like that. The light will not go like that and it will not go like that. You may have read books that say light can do that. Well, don't, don't worry about those books. We're doing geometrical optics. If you just make the simple geometrical assumption that light will take the minimum time to get from A to B, you can drive quite a bit of geometrical optics, and that's what we're gonna do.